What's up? Welcome to downtown Columbia and Sumter Street here at the YMCA. I'm Tyler Ryan, and it's season three of Get Social Columbia. Excited about that? Very excited. Now, this is not Gio with a dye job. She's actually off doing her mama thing for the show. So uh, standing in her stead, if you will, is our Get Social Columbia producer, Rebecca Farmer. Say hi. Hey, Columbia. <laughs> and everywhere else, right? Yes. In the world. Say hi to your mom. Where's your mom live? Kentucky. Can you see? Well, it's more than Kentucky. We're in Kentucky. Louisville, Kentucky. Louisville. Hi, Louisville, because you know Mom's going to watch us, right? Absolutely. Right. Listen, we're going to get our workout on the YMCA. There are five YMCAs around the area. Do you know that? Five. five. Count them. Count them five. Mm -hmm. We're at the downtown one. We're going to find out about the programs, and uh, we're going to get huge today. Are you ready? So ready. Did you eat your Wheaties? I did. All not right. eat them. I'm sorry. Should have. <laughs> we're It's season three, y'all. Get ready. Season three! Season three! I can't believe it. We're going to get social. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back. Season three of Get Social Columbia. I'm so excited. Are you ready to work out, by the way? I'm totally ready to work out. We're going to uh, seriously get our pump on a little while. Let's do some stretching. Do you do yoga? Yep. Uh, That's I like don't do yoga. Hey, have you heard of the, um, the Hero's <laughs> Vest Fund? Does it scare you? It scares you? <laughs> Just a little bit. It's kind of weird and awkward, but... <laughs> You know, sometimes it gets you in trouble. The, uh, have, you, have you heard of the Heroes Vest Fund, by the way? Just a little bit. Tell me more about it. It is a, Well, okay, Rebecca. I'm so <laughs> glad you asked. It is actually, it's, a new, uh, it's a new group based here in Columbia. But what they do is they raise money to buy bulletproof vests for the canine police dogs. Um, canine police dogs get attacked all the time because they're trying to catch the bad guys, and bad guys do stupid things to the dogs. Well, this group of people get together, and they buy the vests, which run about 1000 bucks per dog. So they're trying to go ahead and outfit. They're going to start in Lexington County, go to here in Richland County, and then go beyond and eventually na nationwide. But it's heroesvestfund.org. Plus, I love their spokesman. Who's their spokesman? His name's Tyler. He's really good. Sure. And anyways, also coming up. <laughs> Just let him know it's me. It's him. It's, he's a spokesman. Anyways, also coming up here in Columbia, the Trans-Siberian Orchestra is going to be in town on December 3rd. It's a Friday at 8 mm -hmm. p.m. Tickets are starting around $27. Yeah. And go to colonialliferena.com uh, for more information about that. And if you haven't seen that, that is the coolest show. There's music and lasers and all kinds of fun stuff. We so. want tickets. We, please, we're not afraid to beg. At least I'm not anyway. <laughs> Hey, you know what, if you, uh, if you are in business, whether you own a business or you are, say you're a banker or a loan guy or whatever, uh, you need to look at joining your local chambers of commerce. Uh, they're all nonprofits and they all do such great work for the community and, and of course in business, great for leads and it's time where businessmen and women are struggling for every single sale and lead they make. Uh, check out the chambers, there's the Greater Irmo Chamber, West Columbia, Lexington, downtown, they're all over the place. Um, but so worth the price of admission to become a chamber member. So make sure you join your local chamber. Just a little, the more you know for you. And also, the more you know, we've got the Divine Night Out coming up also on December 9th from 5 to 10 p.m. There's going to be holiday shopping all along Divine Street and then an after party at Momo's Bistro where there's going to be tons of different raffle prizes and even a diamond giveaway. Are you trying to get engaged? I'm trying to get that diamond. That's for sure. Women are always like that, aren't they? They just want the diamond. What is up with that? I'd be okay without it, I guess. Nice. Hey, don't go anywhere. We're going to talk to Megan Plott, who's the communications director here at the YMCA, and learn about all five floors here, plus uh, the other four, this is five, but the other four locations around the Midlands and beyond uh, where you can get your workout on. Why don't you go out and jog a little? I'm going to, uh, I'm going to take a break. Just warm up a bit? Yeah, go, yeah. go run on the block. <laughs> we'll be right back. Welcome back, everybody, to Get Social Columbia, Season 3. Today we are here with Megan Plott, who's the Communications Director of the YMCA of Columbia. That's right. Now, Megan, I love this. You know, the, the YMCA is there's five now. Right? Yes, five branches in the association. Yeah, because, or um, what is it, um, Orangeburg? Orangeburg's the newest branch, open in April. We have Northwest in Irmo, Lexington, over on that side of town, the Jeep Rogers branch in Lake Carolina, and then, of course, downtown. Now, is it true there's a water park down in Oberg? That is true. <sighs> Yes. Can I wear my Speedos? I don't think you'd get kicked out for that. You don't think I would? No. There's no way I'm going to wear Speedos down in Orangeburg. <laughs> I'll get beat up. You ever been to Orangeburg? <laughs> What's down there? Is there water slides? There are water slides. There are several. Um, it's a huge park. And then, of right. course, a huge YMCA facility also with an indoor um, natatorium and workout indoor facility. Indoor what? It's the... Um, indoor swimming pool. Yes. Thank you, Rebecca. Oh. <laughs> Look who suddenly knows everybody. Hey, yeah. girl. <laughs> She's walking Wikipedia. Very nice. Yes. Um, all the workout facilities that all the branches have, group exercise, mm -hmm. and all the other programs. 
Now we're in the uh, the oldest, one of the oldest buildings probably in Columbia, but yes. some of the oldest building for the Y, the downtown branch. We're on floor five of six. Is there six? Correct. Yes. Five of six. And so there's all kinds of stuff. And I love this branch because it's racquetball. Racquetball. And it's convenient for all the downtown businesses. So tell us what's going on right now at Downtown Y. You said you're right in the middle of a scholarship program? Right. We are in the middle of our Partners with Youth campaign. Um, we're in the second phase of four, which is the board solicitation. First, we start off asking our staff for, for donations and then the board. Then we reach out to our members and then the community as a whole. So um, the, the Partners with Youth campaign allows us to provide scholarships for folks in the community who can't afford to be members otherwise. So it's a great program. Um, we give out a lot of money last year, $400,000. Um, hopefully we'll increase that this year. So the why actually can be for everybody, regardless of whether they can afford a pesky Absolutely. gym price or not. Yes, and our programs are the same. Now, talking about the different branches, each one's got some different things. We're um, we're here downtown. Yes. So you've got what? You've got like a whole Nautilus room here. What other cool stuff are, is there at this particular branch? Um, on the sixth floor, we have group exercise rooms. Mm -hmm. Also on the fourth floor, group exercise. That's where the track is, a big running the track. The third floor is the track. And, I can't keep um, up all the floors. Yeah, there are a lot. On the second floor, we have the full-size basketball court mm -hmm. and um, and the, on the very first well it's actually not the first floor on the basement we have this the swimming pool we have um, body pump coming to the Y starting in January mm -hmm. we're very excited body pump is a popular program Rebecca, and can you display some body pump for us body yes, pump? please yeah okay like Just pump it up pump it up <laughs> gotta breathe that's right. It's really important. Mm -hmm. Is that what body pump is? Body pump is actually a lot more fast paced. It's choreographed. <laughs> Look out, Denise Williams. Yeah. Or Denise, what's what's her name? What, what's her Richardson. name? Richardson. Yeah. No, yeah. that's no. Isn't that the idiot who's married to uh, Charlie Sheen? That no. Is, yeah. No, Denise um, Austin. Denise Austin. I don't know. See, it's ColumbiaYMC.org is all the. Uh, ColumbiaYMC.org, where you can go to find out everything we have going on from our programs, group exercise schedules, mm -hmm. closings. Yesterday we were closed for Thanksgiving. Right. Um, all of our up-to-date information is on the website. Megan Plott, the communications director of the Columbia Area YMCA's, and thank you for having us out. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna do some treadmill stuff, I think. Tyler, what are you doing? I'm just hanging around. Come on, that was funny. <laughs> That's good stuff. <laughs> Welcome back, y'all. <laughs> Serious. We're gonna work out in just a couple of minutes. The boys are working out upstairs. We're down in the bottom floor of the YMCA. It's kind of the free weight room, and I bet as a chick, these things scare you, don't they? Um, not so much. You telling me that you don't walk in a room like this, see a bunch of beefcakes, and you, you feel all right lifting little weights without pink on the weights? I don't mind it. Well, then you're... Machines are, machines are great. You are tougher than I am. I know. I'm stronger than I look. <laughs> all Brian, Brian at All Natural Science, that just totally threw me. Brian at All Natural Science, uh, you got to stop by. If you need any sort of signage, in fact, he does the Social Columbia stuff, the car and different things like that, but he does some great sign work. Um, he can get you, you know, the nice big banner signs. If you want a vinyl banner, if you want something on your car, you can see Brian. He's got a Facebook page connected to Social Columbia, but it's uh, All Natural Science. Stop by and see Brian for all that great stuff. Cool. We'll put Rebecca, we'll put produced by Rebecca Farmer at the bottom. That's me. <laughs> okay, well, um, not only that, but don't forget that the Nutcracker is coming up December 3rd through 5th at the Coger Center. Need to get out and see that. It's a holiday favorite. That so, could be fun. It could be a lot of fun. Let's, fellas, let's leave the jokes at home. <laughs> it's true. All right, I'm, uh, I'm going back to working out here. Okay, we're good. Yep, good luck with that. One, <laughs> two, three. Tyler, what are you doing now? I'm doing some shopping. I walk into the YMCA and there's like this big box of food. I mean, I've got some, uh, some stovetop stuffing and everybody's favorite, pork and beans. Tyler, so. this isn't for shopping. Well, there's a big thing of food here and this well, This is going frankly, to yeah. the Harvest Hope Food Bank as part of the YMCA's canned food drive. Well, I'm hungry. It's not for you. It's for people in need. Next time you're at the YMCA, come in and bring your canned goods that'll all go to the Harvest Hope Food Bank. Yes, well, what about the pork and beans? Think they noticed one can of pork and beans? All right. Well, listen, we just had our workout. We got it on. I'm a little sweaty. You are gamey, by the way. I didn't want to say anything out loud, but who doggy? We had a good workout here at the YMCA, the great programs they have. Remember, if you can't afford, uh, afford a membership, you can get a grant and you can actually have a scholarship and still work out. It's about getting families together and being fit and leading healthy lifestyles at the YMCA. 
So I guess uh, I guess we're done. I guess it's time. One more time. Season what? Season three. Uh huh. Next time we're going to be at the Holiday Inn over on 378 in Lexington, right by the hospital. This hotel is so cool. They are totally green, and I'm talking all kinds of neat things from the shape of the pool to to the chairs that are actually recycled milk cartons. A sustainable hotel. Sustainable. That's a good word. Sustainable. Let's, let's write that down. I just call it green. Anyway, that's next time, but thank you for watching. And don't forget, by the way, ads at socialcolumbia.com. If you want us to uh, be a part of your business, I'm not sure why you would, but if you do, then you can do that. Plus, you can advertise right here at socialcolumbia.com. Thanks for watching. Get Social Columbia. See you next week. It's time. This is how this works. I know you're new. <laughs> it's time. Go. Go get social, Columbia. Go get social. See you next time. And get fit. Get social and get fit. At the same time. <laughs>